guys, welcome to Daily Research Plot. So, in a very short amount of time, La Casa de Papel, otherwise known as Money Heist, has released its final episodes on Netflix today. Fan favorite members of the cast will return for one more outing, including Alvaro Morte as the professor, Ursula Cabero as Tokyo, Pedro Alonso as Berlin, and Jamie Lorenete as Denver alongside the rest of the gang and their adversaries. If you are about to watch The Money Heist Season 5 Part 2, you should watch this video first. Hi, I'm Sheila, and without wasting any more time, let's start the video now. of the final five episodes of the Spanish heist drama Metro.co.uk attended a press conference where the stars and creators of the series opened up about what fans can expect for the highly anticipated conclusion, having premiered four years ago. What to expect from part two of season five? You should have been expecting this already, but prepare to cry a lot. The final moments of season five, part one, featured one of the most emotional scenes in the entire drama, as Tokyo sacrificed herself by strapping grenades to her body inside of a bank of Spain after being shot multiple times in her arms and legs. Director and executive producer Jesus Calmanar explained that part one was a pure adrenaline, making it a brutal experience for both the cast and the crew. Part two, on the other hand, is more emotional. Although it is still full of adrenaline and unexpected twists and turns, he says, I think it has a different pace. It's not such a warlike confrontation, but it's a series that is always in crescendo until the end, until the last episode. And I will say that it is a very special one and different to what we've done until now. With executive producer Esther Martinez Lovato and Alex Pina also in attendance at the conference, the later of two, who is the creator of the show, they emphasize that while the first volume of season five was an action epic, the second part is an emotional epic. From Tokyo's lasting impact to the heart-wrenching final scenes the actors filmed, this is what we learned. Tokyo may be gone, but her legacy lives on. As the narrator of the show, fans couldn't believe it when it was confirmed that Tokyo had been killed. However, the trailer for season five, part two confirmed that she is still part of the series beyond the grave through flashbacks and possibly still as a narrator. What's more, her death will inevitably have a significant impact on how the rest of the show pans out. The creator said the fifth season, volume one and two, have this watershed moment, which is the death of Tokyo. It's a ticking bomb, really, that changes the show radically, and it does veer towards the end. They outlined how final episodes of the show will pay homage to all of the characters and provide them with room to show a bit of their heart and soul. While Berlin has died far back in the show, he's continued to be a pivotal part of the plot, enlightening viewers of the history of other characters, including his brother, Professor, and Palermo, aka Berlin. Considering he hasn't shared scenes with many of the other gang members in the present day for a while, Berlin actor Pedro explained that it was strange to film a final scene on his own. The actor explained that as the series was initially supposed to consist of two parts, he had already bid farewell to his character before it was acquired by Netflix and came back for more episodes. Helsinki's injury remains a grave situation as many fans are undoubtedly wondering how the lovable Helsinki is doing after his leg was crushed in part one. Darko, who's playing the character, revealed that the character is still in a tight spot, recollecting the fun memories he had on set with Palermo actor Rodrigo amid the deep heartfelt connection between their characters. As this is gonna be the last season of the show, do you think that it's gonna end at the right time? 
Comment your opinion in the comment box below. This is Sheila signing off today, but I will be back for another video. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button and share it with everyone. And please hit the red subscribe button and make it gray if you're watching the video on YouTube. Or you can like our page if you're watching it on Facebook. Thanks for watching. Bye.